Hey, who's there? I see somebody. Don't hide on me. Don't act like that. Be social. Tell me who you are. Or don't. That's fine. <laughs> What's happening out there? I just came from Michael's vlog. I did not see what happened at Michael's vlog. I was in and out of it. I just know something bad happened. Maybe I'm glad I didn't go tonight. Hey, Rhonda. What's happening out there? I didn't see anybody live streaming, so I thought I'd go on for a second. See how everybody's doing tonight. How y'all doing tonight? Said my best, best, Beth. My best Southern charm. We lost somebody, so hey, you know what? I'm not crying. Oh, I'll get off then. I'm not gonna stay on somebody else's live. Tracy Sharitz is live. Is that who it is? I didn't get a. I didn't get a. Um, I didn't get a thing in Bobber a, a notification. Is she doing trivia, Rhonda? Hey. She's not doing nothing. <laughs> I'm not doing nothing either. Uh, well, I'll go if I need to go. I'll get off here and clear the way for Tracy. I'm being quiet, waiting on y'all to tell me. She needs to sing. She can come to me for, she can come to me for, um, uh, I spent the last year on Rocky Mountain Way. I couldn't get much higher. An mountain pasture, I think it's safe to say. It's time to open fire. We don't need the ladies crying cause the storm is sad. Uh -huh. Because the Rocky Mountain Way is better than the way we had. He's telling us this and he's telling us that. Changes every day. He says it doesn't matter. Bases are loaded in case he's as bad. He's playing it play by play. It's time to change the pattern because we don't need the ladies crying because the story is sad. Oh no, because the Rocky Mountain way is better than. Go over there. It's okay. I just jumped on for a second. I didn't know anybody was on. So I'm just let's see if there's another one. Just lock that one. Um. I got a little change in my pocket, going jing a ling a ling. I'm gonna call you on the phone. I'm gonna give you a ring. Each time that I call, I get the same old thing. No hugging, no kissing, like in a red and rain. I said, my honey, my baby, don't put my love upon the shelf. She said, don't give me no lines and keep your hands to yourself. Hmm. I don't. You think I know those words? Let's be serious. I don't know those words.
<laughs> I'm gonna get in trouble. Y'all gonna get Tracy after me. I don't know many black crows. Why you wanna treat me this way? You know I'm still your lover boy. You know I feel the same way. That's what she told me a story. I was free milk and a cow. Said no hug, no kissing. Till I get a wedding now. I said my honey, my baby. Better put my love upon the shelf. She said don't give me no lines. And keep your hands to yourself. Talk so loud, she's gonna know we're over here cheating. Shh. Shh. Don't tell Nobody has to know our secret that we're doing a secret live stream. Don't tell her, don't tell nobody. Shh. Oh, I know. Well, I don't know some, I know some of their stuff, but I don't know some of their stuff. Like, you know, Shh. she'll hear you laughing, Rhonda. Hush. Stay quiet under the radar. Shh. Uh, throwing on the but oh, she talks to angels. Yeah, I know that a little bit, but not enough to play it. You know me. Burp. Did y'all hear that? <laughs> y'all. I'm looking at songs. You should all just pay attention to Tracy. Don't pay attention to me. <laughs> oh, that was a good song. That's way high. I need to pull that back a little bit. That's too low. You know I'm only gonna play about three seconds of this song and y'all gonna want me to play more. Hang on, let me find the words to this. My love was meant to be Ooh. the kind of love that lasts forever. And I want you here with me from tonight until the end of time. I'm gonna miss this. In my heart, in my soul. You know that part? <laughs> yeah, but I don't know this one, so you can just go. Because I was terrible right there on those chord changes. I have to work on that. I can't be right. I see. Pick something I can't even play. Because I got hard. You know, I need to do that before you on a, on a vlog or on a thing. So not a vlog, but a... Um, I need to do that one on a, um, a recorded one because that's one I've been actually meaning to do for you, Rhonda. <laughs> hey, Amber, I'm, I'm covering up Tracy's live stream. I don't mean to be. I messed up. I didn't know she was live streaming. I'm just goofing off. I'm really not doing much. <laughs> yeah, Rhonda, I gotta do that one. I gotta have to do that one on AM. 
because I don't know it that well. Long as I'm hard, used to yell my heart. You listen to the end, rolling out his note and tone. You think about, think about the woman or the girl you knew last night before. No, no, I'm not even going to try that one. Here I am. He gets that little thing. Am. I'm on the road again. And there I am. Up on the stage. And here I go. Playing star, star again. There I go. Turn the page. Yeah, that's about all I can do of it. I don't know it well enough to do it. Is Tracy singing yet? Seriously, is she singing? Or is she just acting like she's gonna sing? Somebody tell me. Oh, she's not singing. Is she threatening to sing? Is she acting like she's gonna use that karaoke machine? <laughs> this is our secret. This is our secret, because I'm going to get in trouble. Mm. Didn't need to breathe? Oh, absolutely, I know some need to breathe. Um, let me go find some stuff. I mean, I've done stuff of theirs, so but I just need to get back to it so I can just get... Um... Ah, there's one that... Friend of mine does all the time. I gotta think about it. Is um ah, hang on, Amber. I'm gonna find it. Just give me a second. We do multiply it all the time, but there's one. Um, yeah. Amber put me on the spot, and I'm failing. I'm failing, Amber. I'm failing. Um, what's the one that is, um, hang on. That may be it right there. Let's see if this is it. Um. My daddy was a preacher. She was his wife. Just trying to make it in. Oh. I should know this. And people started talking. Just to hear their own voice. Those people try to kiss my body. She made the wrong choice. And even when the rain falls, and even when the flood starts rising, cause even when the storm comes, cause I am washed by the water. And even when the rain falls, and even when the flood starts rising, and even when the storm comes. I am washed by the water Even if the earth crumbles under my feet I don't really know this part Yeah, anyway, I know that one a little um, I lead worship with a guy and students a lot And he pulls that out all the time he'll, This will be in a different, totally different song And he'll just pull that little piece out right there Cause even when the rain falls And even when the flood starts rising even when the storm comes Cause I am washed by the water And even when the rain falls And even when the flood starts rising Yeah, mine too. I love it. But I love a lot of their stuff. Bear can sing. I mean, he just... He's good, you know? They're all good, but obviously He carries so many of those, um... He carries so many of their main... Their main stuff, so... Cause your love is like radiant diamond bursting inside us we cannot contain oh your love will surely come find us like blazing wildfires singing God of mercy, sweet love of mine, and I 
have surrendered to your design. May this offering stretch across the sky as these hallelujahs be multiplied. It's a great song. Great, great song. You made me think of another one of theirs. Thank you. I, I take that as a compliment. I've had a couple people say my voice sounds a little like his. God, I wish I could sing like him. But um, I appreciate that. I really do. Because, man, he is... I saw him in concert a couple times, and he just... I mean, he's got this grit thing that he does sometimes. You know what I'm talking about? Like, he'll sing pretty straight, and then he'll put this little grit thing in it. A Kenny Rogers grit or whatever. I don't know much Bruno. Bruno Myers? No, Bruno Mars? I jump my... Um, I'm actually looking for another multiply, uh, another new debris song. I don't, I don't, not off the top of my head, I don't. Uh, give me some more of their songs. I'm looking for something else. There's a song of theirs I've never done, but I love. Oh man. Yeah. It's crazy. I've seen them at Tennessee Theater, um, and they're just, they're just so good. So good. Although, you know what I heard is my, the guy I just was talking about that I sang, we sing in students a lot. We, he, we lead worship together in students. He saw them just the last time we were here just a few months ago, and he said the concert was really good, but it was overdone. He said it was like just too much stuff. You know, he's like, he's pretty, we just want to hear, <laughs> you know, he just wants to hear the band and each time we've been, it hadn't been too much production, you know? And um, it, he said it was a lot of production. He said it was still good, but you know. Oh, I don't even know this one. Yeah, I do too. You know, um, contract to the BG Theater downtown, like tonight, Mark Broussard was there and somebody else I'd love to saw Mark. I saw, I saw Bruce Hornsby at the Bijou, a small place, and man, it was so good, you know? And so, um, I'm not much on huge artists who do, you know, it's big production stuff, and it's like, and some of them are really good. I mean, some of them put on some good shows and stuff, but even Elton John, when I saw Elton John in Knoxville, he was so good, and it was simple. And, you know, he just did what he did. Of course, he stands on his own, so. I don't know it. Hang on, hang on. Let me see if I can. Let me see if I can oblige you. I don't get kicked off for playing it. Hang on, I'm gonna play a little bit before I hear it. Forgive me. Oh come on! Of course I have to watch a whole ad this time. I can't skip it. Whatever. Let's see if I can recognize this. Talk amongst yourselves. Don't tell Tracy though. I love this video. Hey, Kendra. Russ, what's going on, man? Uh, can't do it where he did it. He'll kill me. Saying the shoot the crazy. It's Bruno Mars. I ain't Bruno Mars. Where am I at here? Let me see. Mm, still not high enough. Go a little higher. I'm cheating a little bit here. Same bed, but it feels just a little bit big now. I song on the radio, but it don't sound the same. I don't know the song. I don't know this song. <laughs> yeah, see, that's all I know. 
Saying that about it feels just a little bit bigger now I saw on the radio but it don't sound the same I don't know where it goes for it. <laughs> I don't know where it goes from there. <laughs> ah, I know. You know what I'm going to do? Because we always get on here and talk about songs that I need to do. And I never write them down. And so I'm actually going to write them down, some songs down this time. So turn the page. I need to, I need to do that one sometime. And this one. Okay, I wrote those down. So maybe I can get around to them. I love that. I love that. Um, what? Is it? You know what? He sounds familiar. I know who it is. I just trying to think of his biggest song that he did. I shouldn't know that. Oh yeah. Well, good God, in this morning, show up the moon. Well, good God, in this morning. Sure like one When you're rockin' and rollin' You can get your mama called mm -hmm. Okay, okay. I need some more words for that. That was right, wasn't it, Russ? Isn't that what you were looking for? <laughs> I don't know it that well, though. Oh, let's do this again. Ah. Uh, well, good girl, I miss Molly. You sure like the ball. Well, good girl, I miss Molly. You sure like the ball. Keep this and that. When you're rocking and rolling, you can hear your mama call. Oh, from the early, early morning to the early, early night. See Miss Molly rocking all the night. Well, good golly, Miss Molly, will you show like the ball? When you're rocking and rolling, you can hear your mama call. I don't even know this line. I'm going to the corner to buy a diamond ring. Shut me, you kiss me, make me. I don't even remember that part of the song. I remember that other part of the song. Y'all made me think of another song. Mm -hmm. I can't sing that. Old time. Can't do that. Hey, Amber. Good to see you tonight. Hope you have a great night. Thanks for stopping by. A little Richard do. Ah. I got a trusty computer. It's here helping me. Oh, you guys up. <laughs> Keep it knocking, but you can't go in. Keep it knocking, but you can't go in. Keep it knocking, but you can't go in. Come back tomorrow and I can try it again. <laughs> oh, do the first. Oh, Man, that's faster. He killed that one. Uh, um, yeah, I can do that one. I need some words. You know, it's funny. All these blues songs. Once you get the riff on blues, you can play any blues songs because it's, um, it's all the same. You know. Uh, well, come on over, baby. Oh. Me and baby, oh, lot of shaking going on. Well, I said, come on over, baby, we got chicken in the barn, barn, barn. Come on over, baby, we got the bull by the horn. We and baby, a whole lot of shaking going on. I said, shake, baby, shake, shake, baby, shake. I said, shake it, baby, shake. Shake it, baby, shake. We ain't a whole lot of shaking going on. I said, shake it, baby, shake. Shake it, baby, shake. Shake it, baby, shake. Shake it, baby, shake. We ain't a whole 
lot of shaking going on. Something like that, yeah. There you go. There's your <laughs> little piece of whole lot of shaking. I don't think my timing was right, but hey, I faked it well enough. Again, you can fake any blues song, just about three chords. All the blues you need to know. Pretty close, anyway. Okay. I was looking at Long Tile Sally. Yeah, man, he did some, some really good stuff. You got me now. Y'all got me searching from older people. <laughs> uh, I was looking at I'm, I again. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna embarrass him by doing his songs. He's not here. God rest his soul. But Chuck Berry did some great stuff too. <laughs> uh, calm down. Shh, just take it easy. We gotta take it easy, you know. Some gospel. BTD. We're supposed to be incognito over here, BTD. It's quiet over here. We're we're just hanging out. We're not doing anything. You know? Hey, let's uh, let's see if this guy has anything I can do. I'm not gonna tell you who it is till I find all oh, till I find him. I'm looking. I'm looking. Just give me a second. Y'all too funny. Y'all make me laugh. Okay. On that one, Rust, I'm just going to have to say no. So <laughs> we could do some Inner Sandman, something like that. But no, that'd be Metallica. That's not even Megadeth. See, I don't even know any Megadeth stuff. Hey, like that. Well, while I consider my, um, while I consider my repertoire right, <laughs> right, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry, man. So like, something like that right there. Is that close? <laughs> uh, I'm still looking. Don't 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 give up on me. I'm just um, certain songs are coming to me. So I'm gonna I'm gonna look for this guy. Because again, I'm so terrible with titles of songs. It's terrible. When we play Name That Tune, we might, I might as well forget it. Was that, see? I, was, I told you, dude. I was. Something like that. Oh, too funny. Uh. Yeah, you know. There's your two seconds, like I always do. Russ, you're going to find it really quick. I do like two seconds of a song and I move on. I don't know what it is. Ah, cool. I like Mel and Kemp stuff. I was looking up some Bruce Springsteen stuff. Just, um... Oh, that's a good song. I don't know if I know this one. No, I don't know that one enough to do it. I was looking at pink houses. I know it, but I don't know it. Again, I got old old person brain sometimes. Springsteen's good too. Yeah, I need to go back to him. I had him up for a second. Let's see if there's anything he has on the right off the top of my head. 
Tracy's still on out there? She's still she's still going. Who came on? Did Bob uh, did Misfits and Dreamers? Did Bob come on? I, I don't know this. I don't want this, guys. I'm sorry. I'm not talking to you all. You're fine. Here we go. Hey, what's going on, man? How's that knee? We want to hear a good report. We hope. <laughs> Oh, man, he did some good stuff, too, but I don't know his stuff that great, but... Man, I haven't heard that name in a while. Yeah. Well, dude. Yeah, see, I recognize, like, the titles of some of his songs, but I don't recognize them enough to play it. If I had his hair, though, I could be famous, I think. Kramer hair, Lyle Lovett hair. Bob, what, what set you off so bad? Is it always like this, or is, did something happen, or is it just just life in general? It hurting like that. We don't like to see you hurting, my man. Yeah, I'm done looking. I'm gonna talk to y'all for a second. What you gonna cook? Sounds good. Think of a song about food, but I really can't. We can make one up. I like burgers and shakes. Everything you make. <laughs> Beef and bananas too. It sounds Mexican, Bob. I hope it is. Cause I like Mexican too. Y'all ever heard that one? <laughs> that just got me being goofy now. <laughs> Is that a tomato? I see. Since Bob is just a your cooking show songs. We'll just sing about what you're cooking. <laughs> ah. It actually sounds good though. I can't have it yet, but it sounds good. Ah, let's see. I don't know. It sounds like a Disney song. Somewhere out there Beneath the pale blue sky Yeah, I don't know that. That's what it sounds like there. Made chicken casserole tonight with cheese and broccoli. Ooh, that sounds good. I had a, on this diet thing I'm doing, there's a certain kind of pizza. It's actually really good. I've gotten where I enjoy it. Um, it's turkey bacon, some turkey on it. Um, we just use a flatbread instead of a crust, like a 90 calorie flatbread, and get it crispy and then put stuff on it. But it was good. It's a kind of a nice treat. And so it was good tonight. Can I think of his name? Oh yeah, I thought of his name. He's there. I can do that. Um, I'm, I'm getting ready to transition. I've been pretty anal about eating what I'm supposed to be eating, but I'm about to transition into more maintenance because I'm about where I want to be on weight loss now. And so I've got to start, um, I got to start doing some different things and adding some things like what you just said. That sounded really good. Um, I'm looking at this guy. Hang on. I'm going to find some of his, some of his songs. 
I used to do one of his songs. I sang one of his songs at my wedding. Um, my wife didn't know it. We At our wedding, she didn't know I was going to sing. She thought my cousin was going to sing it. So he had his guitar there, and I was up front with her, and he started to play. She thought that my cousin was going to sing the song, and I ended up singing it. It was great. I cried. You know, whatever. I... Is. I don't even remember what it was. Okay, come on. I did. Oh, I do all the time. Psh. See him? That's too high. I'm gonna shoot again. Look into my eyes and you will see just what you mean to me. I quit doing, um, I, I, I want to see that last, what was that last comment? Um, here it is, you Pastor Evans. No, I'm actually a worship pastor. I'm an associate pastor I'm on the lead team in our church, but I, I take care of quite a few things, but a worship pastor, worship is my main thing. I do help lead the students worship, but I'm not the student pastor because I would kill some students. Um, funerals and weddings. I gave them up. Yeah, Brian Adams. Dude, I love Brian Adams. Um, I gave up weddings. They're just too much pressure. You know, if it's a really good friend and they want me to sing a song, but playing them, I'm done. It's just too much and too much. I just can't stand it. Funerals are different. Of course, I'll do, I, I mean, I'll do so much funeral if they need me to. Um, I did my own mom and dad's funeral and I, I um, that Go Rest High that I sang last time we were on from Vince Gill. I did that at a funeral and um, I don't do a lot of them though. You know, um, funerals are different. Funerals are Somebody's, somebody's having a hard time. It's compassion, but weddings? Yeah. Oh. Look into my eyes and you will see just what you mean to me. Well, search your heart. I missed it. And search your soul. When you find me there, you'll, you'll search no more. If I get this, but don't tell me it's not worth trying for. Ooh. Can't tell me it's not worth dying for. It is a good song. You know it's true. Now, what movie was it with? Everything I do. Oh, this is terrible. I do it for you. You guys got me cracked up. Ah. <laughs> Listen, dude, it's part of it. I don't try. You know, I want you guys to know the real me, not the fake I'm perfect and play perfect. I sure don't. I mean, I love what I get to do, and I have a blast doing it, but it's work sometimes. I don't... Sometimes some songs come easy and some songs are just like, whoa, I missed that. Plus, I'm not. I'm back here in my back room. I'm not belting these songs out. I'm just kind of singing low. So, so. Ryan, you know, that name is familiar. I'm sure I know um, who it is. Do I know their songs, though? I don't know. Let me look. Rust. <laughs> that was a good one. That was a good one, Bob. <laughs> Can anybody get the movie? Did anybody tell me the movie it was three? No, it wasn't Three Musketeers. Yes, there you go, Rust. I see the correction. It was Robin Hood. I don't want to tear the house down if I built one out. You see, when I sing on here with you guys or I record something on here and post it on the channel, I'm doing it a couple of keys lower than I usually would because you just have to get way on top of it. I know. 20 favorite Ron Adams songs. No, I think I would know it if I heard it, Russ, but I don't think just looking at his stuff, I, it just doesn't come right to me. I was thinking, bro. Yeah, I don't know. That one, Russ, I'm sorry I have to touch the screen because I'm having to, I'm having to um, pull back to see. Right, I was thinking one for all of Russ, too. Was one, is that a movie or you about a song one for all because I can't I can't bring that to my it's not coming to me why well, it's nothing new no holds bars oh I'm 
I can't I'm waiting on you to come up with a song. You said you were trying to think of one y'all used to do. Your worship band used to do. I probably will know it. Probably. I'm not promising. <laughs> Oh, they sang it together. Huh. Tracy, Tracy went J. Uh, Tracy went J, think. No. Put the bottle down, BTD. <laughs> okay, there you go. <laughs> You're not supposed to be picking up the red solo cup that Rhonda uses. You stick to your tea, okay? We need one of you. We need one of you with sanity, you know? Yep, I hear you laughing, but you know it's true. I love Rod Stewart. Yeah, we usually sing at the beginning and we end with a real short 30 second song or something usually at the end, something like that. Actually, you have me in my worship. Um, hey, hey, Karen, how you doing? It's like, hey. Ah. How you doing? Orange water, Do you, is that really what's in there? Because that's all I drink is orange water, by the way. It's my life now. Doing great here. Really good. I'm actually looking through some songs here. Sorry, forgive me. I didn't really plan on getting on tonight. I just thought I would jump on for a second. In fact, I'm going to play Mr. Harvey and tell you my battery's at 20%, and I have no charger in here at all, so. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. <laughs> oh. oh, this is a really good, um, this may be too religious for you. It's okay. I'm good with it. It's too religious. You'll just have to go. All who are thirsty. This is a great song. And all who are we? Just come to the fountain. Dip your heart in the stream of life Let the pain and the sorrow Be washed away In the waves of His mercy As deep cries out Too deep we sing Come Lord and Jesus See you, Karen. Oh, Tracy's back. Okay. Mm. She's singing this song. It's an old worship tune. It's deep cries out to deep. It's deep cries out to deep. Anyway, it just came to me because I just saw it on this, on my long list of stuff here. Okay, she's singing. Tell me she's singing now. She decided to sing. Boy, red eyes tonight. Yeah, it's a great song. I love the, um, there's a chord progression in front of this. I'll get technical for a second. I mean, the words are song, but the words are beautiful, but, um, mm-hmm. I did that one last, I did a little bit of that one last week. Um, this chord progression in front of this one, though, that says, um, all who are thirsty, this next move. And all who are we? Such a nice move. Just come to the fountain. Dip your heart in the stream of life. Let the pain and the sorrow. Here's that move again. Be washed away. Oh, in the waves of his mercy. Cries out too deep to go rest high on that mountain. Lord, your word is low on earth is done. And go to hell. It's almost too low to sing. Uh, 
shout love for the Father. And that was low. I just watched a. Um, oh, you know it. Not in that key, you don't. So go rest high on that mountain. Lord, you work <laughs> on earth is done. And go to. I can't even hit that now. That comment cracked me up. I need to pull me to the gutter. Um, do you ever watch? Do y'all do y'all get um, Access TV? It's A X A X S. A lot of music. Um, um, yeah, man, I do. That's what I do. I'm a worship pastor, so I do a ton of it. Um, do y'all watch Access TV, or do you get it at home? A lot of music. Dan Rather does a lot of. Um, Dan Rather does a lot of interviews on it. Um, he was just interviewing Vince Gill. Oh, I just watched it a couple of days ago. I've watched it before. It's an older one, but man, that guy can sing so high. He makes it sick. Hey, Leslie. Uh, no, but you got me thinking of something else. Um, uh, let me see. Can't even play that. I'm sorry. You got me thinking of the Commodores. It made me think of Celebration, but I don't know the words of that. I mean, I don't know the course of that. Why do I know? I don't. I know. Do I know Cell on? I don't know by heart. What's going on? Oh yeah, <laughs> amazing! I'm telling you, Bob, that guy. They were doing one of his old original songs, and man, he just—he's just singing in the roof. And then it's not just his singing. I don't know, you know, it depends on if you're bent to listen to him sing or if you're a musician or you know a little bit about musicianship, but that guy can pick a guitar like nobody's business. And it's just that he's just really tasteful and he knows what to play and when to play it. There's there's something to being a, a really good, what I call a solo musician. Not just, a, I'm, just a, I'm just a quarter, I just chord a lot, you know, I'm not great at all that stuff. But there's something to somebody like Vince who's so good, Vince Gill, at filling the song out. Did y'all see when he sang, um, uh, when he sang, a, uh, when he sang, let's see, Oh Lord my God, when he sang with uh, Carrie Underwood, when I in awesome wonder consider all the world thy hands have made. I see the stars I hear the rolling thunder, thy power throughout the universe display. Then sings my soul, I can't get up there, and my Savior God to thee. Anyway, if you saw him and Carrie sing that, if you tell me, if you, if you saw him and Carrie do that that one time, if you haven't seen it, you've got to look it up. It's kind of impromptu. It's not impromptu. They planned it, but they sing it, and he picks a verse of it. It's really amazing though, because they're in the middle of um, they're in the middle of um, something like that. Anyway. Him and y'all keep me from my thoughts. Him and um, Carrie sing it, and when you watch the crowd, man, there are a bunch of country artists there, and they're they're crying. I mean, they're just flat on all of them. People starting to stand up, and um, it's really cool to watch. I'm gonna get religious for a second because you all know what I do, but it's really cool to watch a secular moment like that turn into a really spiritual moment when the Lord shows up and His presence comes, and that's what that was. They were in a secular setting, and you know. Even Carrie and Vince, were, Carrie was almost broke down singing it. And um, anyway, all that to say, when he picks that particular verse of how great um, thou art, um, man, it is crazy how good it was because it was so sensitive and so, I don't know. Anyway, yeah, it's, it's fun to watch that happen. It really is. Um, 
did y'all did y'all did y'all watch America's Got Talent this last season? Uh, I don't know if you remember the guy named Michael Ketterer. He um, came in probably fifth or fourth or something like that. But um, tell me if you if you remember this guy from America's Got Talent. And um, anyway, he. I used to, he sang, he came and moved here for a while and sang on our worship team, and then he moved to California. And uh, the, the, the Simon was Simon was taken with him. Simon Cowell, of all people, was just, they were, he was enamored with him. He was like, man, this, I don't know what it is about you. And even, uh, was it Spice? One of the Spice Girls was on there, Sporty Spice. I don't know, anyway, um, how he was on there. And she kept saying he would sing, and she was like, you're not, it's not that you're that crazy good. Um... Uh, I'm trying to think. He was just a younger guy. Well, I say he's probably 30. Um, he was the one that had the kids. He, they adopted the kids. One of those kids, uh, Rodeo, is actually in a wheelchair, and they've adopted three or four other kids. They only have one girl that's their own. You probably remember the story more than you would anything. He's got five kids. Um, one of them One of them has, um, I'm not sure the disease he has, but um, and then he has um, three other adopted children along with Rodeo. Yeah, that's him. That's him. Anyway, sang with that guy quite a bit. And um, I was laughing because all the judges were so blown away by him. Simon Cowell was taken by him. I mean, he was just, he was just, um, no, this guy was from California. Uh, he, he was from Tennessee originally. In fact, he lived in, lived in Chattanooga. Anyway, the judges were going crazy with him. Uh, just, just couldn't believe how good he was. And even, even the, what the Spice Girl was like, listen, you're not, you've got a good voice, but you're not just you don't sing and everybody just hits the floor. It's just something about you. They don't know him. They don't know his background. He knows Jesus. I mean, that guy knows Jesus. I mean, uh, maybe the word anointed doesn't mean anything to you, but he, yeah, yeah. Maybe anointed doesn't mean anything, but he's anointed. And so what those guys were feeling was the Lord. That's, yeah, because it was Jesus in him. And I, it's just, it. it's so cool to watch a guy sing secular songs. Uh, dude, that's what I'm talking about right there. It, it makes a huge difference. It's so cool to watch a guy on a secular song, se secular show, sing a secular song, and they're all just like, "Oh my God!" You know, they're blown away. Simon Cowell, remember the, the one of the last times you sing, um, Kyra Banks, I think, was the host. Talk went okay. Simon talked to us, and Simon started to say something and started to break down, and she wouldn't let him. He wanted to move on. He was like, "Just go ahead to the next person," and she was like, "No, Simon," you, and he was crying. But dude. It's all Jesus, all the G all Jesus in him, and um, it was so fun to watch. And that guy's so good in a worship setting. Trust me, you thought he was good there. Being with him in a worship set is crazy because he is so so good. He's he's on some of my CDs. Um, talented guy, great guy. So yeah, I'm glad y'all remember him. Let me see where my battery's at. I'm gonna play the battery game because. Mine is really close to being gone. I can't see it. Okay, great. I'll give up then. Okay, guys. It got later than I wanted it to be. I'm almost been on an hour. Um, just wanted to jump on, say hi, hang out. I didn't know Tracy was on, so I'll let some of y'all get back to Tracy. Make Tracy sing. Maybe I'll get on there. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Oh, she gone. <laughs> I appreciate that. Really do. <laughs> well, Tracy's not gone. I may stay a second more. Stayed on my phone. If I just suddenly leave, it's not because I'm mad. It's just because my phone decided it was finished. How's that? You keep... Hmm. Oh, she keeps losing connection. Ah, I see. Hey, so Leslie, I hear you talking worship music or, or just Christian music in general. What do you typically listen to? Is it more mainstream contemporary stuff or worship type stuff or just asking? There's a song. Yeah. I like it. I mean, I have to be in the mood. I, I, I get bored with music quick. Shut up, Rhonda. I don't hear it. And um, I have to, I'm constantly um, listening to a lot of stuff. And so, yeah, I like Southern Gospel stuff. I love the Gaither stuff, you know. And then I'm bored and I'll go on to something else, you know. K. 
can't go back to the beginning. This is a song we did that I love. Can't control what tomorrow will bring. But I know here in the middle is the place where you promise to be. I love this chorus. you come would you meet me here again cause all I want is all you are will you meet me here again great song anyway it keeps going and it's good Oh, you know what, you, you, Leslie, you make me think of stuff that me and my father used to do. Uh, just uh, my dad, we would sing a lot of old gospel tunes. And uh, so, turn your radio on and listen to the music in the air. Turn your radio on, heaven's glory share. Turn the lights down low and listen to the master's radio. Touch with God. Turn your radio on. Turn your radio on. Stuff. Oh my God. Takes me back. Takes me back today from my dad. Oh yeah. We did some fun stuff, man. Oh, miss that guy. He played harmonica, and so he would just go nuts on harmonica, and we'd play stuff, and oh, ton of fun. You make me think of another one. I can't get it in my head though. Listen, I'm not doing all the shrinking I'm doing. I'm not doing no more shrinking. I've lost my weight. I'm done losing my weight. <laughs> I just got to stay this size now. Oh. Looking for something else. Bunch of uh, hymns now. The trumpet of the Lord shall sound, and time will be no more. Mm -mm -mm -mm. He needs to come sing. I just saw that title. When the roll is called up yonder, I'll be there. Still was looking for a specific song. I love so much of the stuff they do. David Phillips, D D Phillips, David Phillips is crazy good. I am too. I'm Pentecostal. I mean, that's we're a non-denom church, but that's kind of how I grew up was Pentecostal. A G actually. So yeah, all right there. I know. <laughs> We do these gospel chords now. Uh, basically, Bob, that's what I am, right? It's good. I like it. Not real religious. Still looking at songs here. I know, I know my battery's going to bump off in just a minute. It ain't going to be long. And then what Larry does all the time, my battery's going. <laughs> plug it up. No, I don't have nothing to plug it up with. Oh, I wish my brain would work when I'm on here. My brain goes to pot when I'm on here all the time. I can't find the song I want. I'm going to keep going this way. Maybe it'll be this way. Nope. Pierce and 
Change it now, too scary now. Oh, yeah, I can do that. Tempted and tried, we're all made to wonder why it should be this and all the day long. And while there are others living around us, never molested. Mm. But though in the wrong, and Father alone. that <laughs> I love that song makes me think of another old one but I can't man it's just it's not coming to me uh, what's the one it's an old gospel song about the hearse kind of sad actually uh, we need you here to play bass LBP About your mom, about mom, we buried her in the hearse. Oh, will the circle be unbroken? Oh, by and by, Lord, by and by. Will this a better home awaiting in the sky, Lord? I need some help with a verse. Mm, I want to do a verse of that. Yeah, I love that song. Somebody needs to give me some words. I was standing by my window on a cold and cloudy day. When I saw that hers come rolling for to carry my mother away, everybody, and will the circle be unbroken by and by, Lord, by and by? There's a better. I don't know if I know that. Home away then. In the sky, Lord. In the sky. We might as well do that verse. Set down to take her. Undertake her. I don't know that. For this lady you are carrying, Lord, I hate to see her go. <laughs> Bob, I love it. Oh, I follow. We're close behind her. Try to hold her and be brave. But I could not hide my sorrow when they lay her in the Oh, will that serve? Uh, yeah. Um, take my hand to high, precious Lord, lead me. Ah, oh, that sounds familiar, LBP, but I don't think I, I don't know that I know it. Um, this train I'm riding. 
Yeah, it sounds familiar, but it's familiar, but it's not up here. You know how that goes when you get old. Okay, I'm telling you, my battery's about to go. Y'all don't know it, but I'm just gonna be done. It's gonna be over in a matter of seconds. It's gonna end kaput. Goodbye. Yeah, I might know that one. I wanna see the words. Oh, Josh Turner, yeah. Yeah, but I don't know it that great. Y'all got me doing all the old hymns tonight. Uh, Let's see. On a hill far away stood an old and rugged cross top the emblem of suffering and shame. How I love where the dearest and best uh -oh. for a world of lost and sinners were sin so high. So I cherish, you can't get up there, cherish the old rugged, old rugged cross. played that in such a long time. Oh, golly. What was that, The Last Date? Wasn't that the name of that? It was Floyd Kramer, but... Okay, I was looking up something. Y'all made me think of something else. Uh, okay, let me see if I can find this. Ah, let's do that. Stop being stupid, keyboard. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. But my darling. Oh, that's too high, too. Does it want to play all the time? What? Uh, no, she gets enough of me, trust me. Say that again. Grass. Um, it does your wife make you play all the time? I'd be like, forget that. Oh. <laughs> no, because she don't do the grass. That is my job in this house. Oh. I think she had a tragic experience having to pick up the sticks in the yard. So she's like, mm -mm. and I got a nice riding mower. I'm like, come on, babe. Let's get on it. Nope. You do it. <laughs> yes. I was dancing with my darling. To the Tennessee walls. I miss that. When old friend I happen to see. I introduced her 
to my loved one and why Too high, too late, and too high. See, if we're gonna do that, then we gotta do, we gotta do, uh, uh, Bob, just for you and your t shirts. Well, I wish that I was on old Rocky Top down in the Tennessee hills. Ain't no smog and smoke on Rocky Top, ain't no telephone bills. Once I had a girl on Rocky Top and I fed the other half cap. Guess that meanest wing the sweet ass soda pop and I still dream about that. Rocky Top, you'll always be home sweet home to me. Get ready, good old Rocky Top. Woo, Rocky Top, Tennessee. Rocky Top, Tennessee. I can, I can get kicked out of the state for not knowing that song. I'm in Knoxville. I have to know that song. It's a requirement to live in Knoxville to know the words to Rocky Top. Just about is, by the way. Because Rocky Top, because Tennessee Balls are... Okay, Bob, tell me the story behind that. How did you... you you're always wearing Tennessee shirts and hats. Is it because of your sister-in-law that lives here? What's your affinity with um, with Tennessee? I have to know way up north and you like us down here in Tennessee. So tell us the story, Bob, before I lose you or lose power. Just making sure I don't have a, making sure I don't have a charger in here and I don't. We're waiting, Bob. Bob's not listening to us anymore. So tell us, I really want to hear, what is it because it's because your sister-in-law lives in Wears Valley, or is it something else that, that you're a Tennessee, I don't know if you're a Tennessee fan, I just know you like Tennessee socks, and you like Tennessee t-shirts, and I've seen you, and I think in a hat maybe, so. <laughs> I hear that. It really is, honestly, the Tennessee balls here, during football season, it's a religion down here. I mean, it's just crazy. Um, I don't bleed orange anymore. I used to. My father would get mad. He'd be mad for three days if they lost. Thank God he's not alive today because he'd just stay mad. But um, I do think we're headed in the right direction with Jeremy Pruitt, and it's just going to take a while. So, hey, you know what? We used to never be excited about basketball season. We got something to be excited about because we got a great, um, we got a great basketball team, man. And so... We hopefully we'll make it deep into the tournament. See what uh, y'all are saying stuff. Um, I will follow him. I didn't catch that BTD. <laughs> what are y'all fighting about? I can't. Sister Act. What are they doing, Sister Act? I know they did some Motown stuff. Mm -hmm. hmm. To me back to the 50s. Oh, I will follow him. I will follow him. Follow him wherever he may go. There is a little duty. A lot of to how you can keep, keep me away. Sure, something like that. I don't know that that well. Yeah, it's funny, all right. <laughs> that was funny. Top pants on. Got my top pants on. That's Jimmy Fallon. You ever seen Jimmy Fallon do top pants? I got my top pants on is what it reminds me of. Oh, ain't too funny. I'm just looking at the songs from that. Let me see. Oh, happy day. Oh, 
Oh, happy day when Jesus was. When Jesus was. When Jesus was. He washed my sins away. I know that part, so. Ain't no mountain high enough. Oh, that's a song I love, but I can't do it. I mean, it's a, let's see. Um, why should I feel discouraged? Why should the shadows fall? Why? I don't even know that. I don't know the, I don't know the chords of that. I love this song, though. God, it's a good song. Standing on a rock. I don't think I know that. I love the way y'all carry on. Y'all make me laugh. Double-handed stuff is tough right there. Ragtime. If you ever seen anybody playing good ragtime, enjoy it, because, man, they're good. That left hand has to be so good to play ragtime. I don't have that. Could do enough of it. Got your own thing going. Got your own thing going? Your tapping's as good as mine. I got it. Okay. I love it, man. You're welcome. Come on. We'll take you. You know that. I'm not one of those. I'm Southern. I hate the North. I actually enjoy going up there sometimes. Um, really want to get back to your state. Of course, you know, I want to go to New York City again. I've been a couple times. And when I went, I went on a business trip and my wife was like, you're not going to like it. And I, I wouldn't live there. Don't get me wrong. But I loved it. And um, both times I got to go, it was just a day trip into the city. I didn't have time to, uh, very little sightseeing. I did get to go to the to the top of the Empire State Building and stuff. But it was just too short. And so I've always, me and my wife have always threatened to just take a trip and go out and stay for a little bit of time. Just to, she loves it too. But she didn't think I'd like it. But I absolutely loved it. I loved it. So she's like, you cut your boy because I've lived here all my life. You're going to be stuck. I'm like, no, come on. they just people. In fact, I'll tell you something about up there. They, they just tell you to get out of the way, but they're not mad at you. They're like, get out of the way. Okay, I'm getting out of the way. And then, then they're like, everything's cool. We're cool. Here, they'll just smile at you. Can you please move? And as soon as you move, they'll give you the nastiest look and stab you in the back on the way out. Man. I, thank you. I really appreciate that. Same here, man. I got a three-bedroom house, and we live in one. <laughs> my mother-in-law's downstairs. She's got a nice apartment downstairs, and so it's really cool. It's my mother-in-law's birthday today, actually. I have a great mother-in-law, by the way. She is an amazing person. She, we lost, um, Leslie lost her father in January of last year, and so we built her a nice place downstairs, and well, she did. But um, I had an unfinished garage, and 